Hello, I am in Belvedere. Yes, my first video here in Belvedere. Well, actually, this will be my second one. I did the, uh, sorry about the wind if uh, it's windy, but I did the Belvedere Oasis uh, because it's, I guess, like in other states and stuff, it's like very rare to see an overhead uh, oasis. So that's why I did that. So look out for a video on that. I don't know what order they're going to be in. But I came across this. This here is an abandoned shoe department. Obviously, it's a shoe store. You've probably heard of them because in a lot of malls, they have a store, a big store called Shoe Department Encore. So I, I don't know if Cherry Vale Mall has one of those, and that would be the reason why this would close because Cherry Vale Mall is just down the down the road, just not too far from here. So let's go take a look at this. So here you go, here's a sign for the shoe department here. Yep, it sits in front of a Walmart as you're gonna see in the reflection. So let's go take a look at this and see what this looks like here. So there's where the sign would have said, very nondescript building. Looked like it was built in the last uh, 15 or so years. Very nice day out, finally caught a Saturday where it's nice outside, nice and sunny. 80 degrees today is expected in Northern Illinois. All right, right away I see the clearance section back there. Yeah, I think, I think shoe department encores are probably about this big here. Reason why this closed, I'm, I'm not sure. Probably just not enough population to support it. Maybe just the store was just entirely too big. Square footage was too big, maybe. I don't know, that's what it seems like. This is about how big like their mall stores are. Yeah, they fill up a lot of space in a lot of malls that are struggling. Okay, so here you can see the uh, where the cash register was. And yeah, not too much, not 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 a lot of shelves left. Looked like the, a lot of wires been cut up and everything. Yeah, not too much left of this thing here. No shelves or anything. Just the carpet. There's an Applebee's next door, that's rare. Yeah, too bad I'm not hungry right now. I mean, the price, the, the restaurant prices are like way up right now, so I do a lot of cooking at home now. Besides, I'm a better cook than <laughs> these restaurants are. Yeah, shoe department, they, they sell like a they sell like any brand of shoes they want. They have a very wide selection of them um, of shoes. Extremely wide selection of shoes. If there's anything on the other side. I think those are the only windows we have here. But yeah, today I'm gonna do a revisit of the Cherry Vale Mall with this phone here. Give the mall some better respect because it is an important mall. Because I worked at the mall there at one time. Yeah, very nondescript going back there and then there's windows on the other side over there. And on the other side, there's uh, another sign that says shoe department. And there you have it. Kind of a kind of a rare find, I guess. I don't see too many abandoned shoe departments. I think the only other shoe department I know of that's up here that's just called shoe department is in Ottawa. That was built back in 2006 when that Walmart was built. And 
then otherwise like in malls that are like in the Chicago region they're called shoe department encores they're not standalone stores yeah usually these would be like part of a strip mall but this one stands alone it looks like all right then so from Belvedere Illinois if you're not a subscriber to my channel please subscribe to my channel please for a lot more content to come make sure that you like comment share these videos please hopefully this wind is not affecting this i got my mouth close to the microphone god bless you guys continue shopping at your local businesses and continue shopping at your local mall thank you very much you guys are awesome